everybody, it's Lucia. So I'm here today with part three of Shannon Green's Journaling by Fives. And part three is stamps and stencils. So I have a bunch of stamp inks here. I got a whole assortment of colors over here. Some yellows and blues and all kinds of little ones. I got these at Tuesday morning. They were um, a stack for... Um, pretty pretty reasonable so I have those next to me I have some stamps some flowers I have some a big flower and just a image and then I have um, a bunch of little stamps actually I got these for Christmas and I haven't used them yet so I have all these I have some stays on ink ready in case I decide to use those and I have a bunch of stencils. I have this one, this one, this one, this one, and then I pulled out some of these letters. Thought they'd be fun. Maybe some hearts and some numbers. And then I have some bigger stencils that just have random patterns on them. So we'll see what I grab. So, um,. I got everything ready and I have my timer set for 15 minutes and we're going to get started. These are a little thick. They're not wanting to go on very well. And remember, there's 20 pages here. So we're just going to do 20 pages of inks. Let's see. Let's try some green on here. It's a Sunday morning here and it's very, very rainy. Let me put on here. Let's try. Let's try some blue. Hopefully I'll have time and I can go back through with some different um, different colors on these pages. It's better if I pounce.
This has been so fun for me. I've learned a lot. Because I'm new at art journaling and art paint with paints in general. So if this has really helped um, helped me and it's been it's fun. And this one here, let's try it. How about some gold? I might use the same thing, so um. I'll use this heart stencil. It's hard to pick colors when you're going fast. I guess I should just grab.
going around this whole page. I'm not editing these videos at all, so they're just the way they are. So I'm not sure if on this one I will put the music because I'm just not talking that much. keep turning my paints over when I get put them back. I don't know what color I'm grabbing. Okay, there we are at 15 minutes and I still have one, two. Oh, I didn't do too bad, two pages. So I'm just going to go ahead and finish those up. And then we'll do a flip through to see how they look. I like this texture on this one. This is where I glued down the tool.
okay. So that's the last page. So again, this was part three, and this is stenciling or stamping, and I didn't do any stamping, but I might go back later and do some. So these are what the pages look like. Oh, I missed this one. Well, let's fix that. Let me see. What can we put on here? This is something we haven't done. How about we put a flower on it? Okay. Finished. I like this. It looks nice. I like the different colors. How it works out. This one, I like the texture. And then this one. Reminds me of the city with graffiti. I like the way the numbers turned out on it. Okay, that's it. That's part three. I'll be back with part four. Bye.